हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल हेलो गाइस इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव सीन हाउ वी कैन क्रिएट द एंटिटी डाउ एंड डेटाबेस यूजिंग रूम एपीआई हाउ वी कैन क्रिएट दिस कोड इन मेन एक्टिविटी टू इंसर्ट द रिकॉर्ड and how just we click on this button and the record is inserted using coroutines we have learned all these thing in the previous video in this video we are going to learn whenever we click on display it should display all the records available in this user table for that we have to make a coding or button so i am saying here binding dot btn डिस्प्ले डॉट सेट ऑन क्लिक लिस्नर ऑन क्लिक लिस्नर एंड हेयर वी हैव टू कॉल द फंक्शन दिस वन सो अगेन वी हैव टू कॉल इट सो आई एम क्रिएटिंग द लिस्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल सो आई एम क्रिएटिंग द लिस्ट ऑफ यूजर that will be written by the so i'm creating this first of all so i'm giving the name of this uh, user all user of list type and we say user so i declare this and i say where lit in it where lit in it where okay because all the record will come here then uh, uh, i'm using the coroutine global scope dot launch and here i will call this one so all i say all user i make it a small so i say all user equal to user database dot get instance that would be the main activity dot user dao dot display and it will return the value like this now i will display this information for that i am creating one variable we say user data of string buffer type here string buffer and in this string buffer i will add all the information so for that all user dot for each like this way this information will come here so i say uh, that is user data dot append and i say user name equal to plus it dot user name so i can add user id also so user id equal to plus it dot uid like this and next one i say user phone equal to plus it dot 
user form like this way and at the last I say that would be slash n line break so one information will added here and after that I will display this in a function display info and I will pass here user data so I am going to create this method for that create display info this method has been created here so uh, it will have the information to two string like this and I will have here a string and here I will use the alert dialog dot builder this at the rate main activity and I will pass this under builder like this and here builder dot set title so I will add title also so one more thing I will add here or otherwise I can fix this title I say title is user info or I can pass from here also I can say user information like this and I just pass here user we say title string type like this and this title I am passing here like this then builder dot set message that message is the user data and then builder dot set we say auto set cancelable true because I want to cancel it on click and builder dot show so done we have created the title okay and we are passing from here So I think we have done all the records will display and I've tried to run this. So it has come when I click on this display it should information not giving what is the error. We see the error first all user has not been initialized. Okay so error is coming all user has not been initialized because i have used this variable outside of the thread this is the background task and i am performing the operation outside of the thread so what i have to do because it is running in io so i have to create one more coroutine under this using launch and here I have to write my all this code to display information and to add information and here I have to tell this coroutine that this should be run run should be in main thread like this so this part will run in IO thread and this will run in the main thread main means this activity thread because this variable is not accessible outside of this thread this coroutine we are using this coroutine so outside this coroutine IO dispatcher this variable is not accessible so I have to access this within this coroutine that's why I'm creating a one more coroutine under this coroutine that it run under the main coroutine and 
add the information and display information so i think it will run now and we are starting to run again now started so when i click on this display button you see the two records are coming and i insert one more record like uh, rahul kumar and i enter some information insert say record inserted and then display so we have the three records now so like this we can have the insertion and display the record using room api from the sqli database thank you for watching my video